Welcome to another Look Smarter Than You Are with Oracle S-Based Tech Ref series. I'm Glenn Schwartzberg, and I'll be your host today for using the MDX Accept function. So when do you use Accept? What is it? Well, it allows you to filter out members from a set. We can use this in case statements, in row or column members on reports, in where or filter clauses in reports. It's very useful in MDX partial data clears for formulaic members because a clear will fail if you explicitly reference members that are dynamic. What you could do is you could use an UDA on them and exclude what you want to clear. And I'll show you an example of that. So what is the syntax? It's accept set one, set two, and all. Set one is compared to set two. The all option is optional and it allows you to retain duplicates. Now, if you've got multiple dimensions in the sets, the two sets must have identical dimensionality and the dimensionality has to be in the same order. In my first example, my partial data clear example, if I said something like alter database ASO sample, clear data in region measures.level zero dot members, physical, some of the members, the measures are dynamically calculated and the partial data clear doesn't like that. And so what I get is I get something that says dynamic members are not allowed in a data clear region specification. So what I did is I went into my outline and I took all of my calculated members and I added a UDA onto them called calc. So now I'm using the accept clause that says for all of the measures level zero members, I want to exclude from it the set of UDAs in the measures mentioned called calc. And so when I do that, I now get a perfectly good clear. How can I use this in a formula? So in this case, I'm saying case when contains geography current member, accept the descendants of geography after. So my first set that I'm looking at is all of the geography all the way down from the top down to the bottom level, excluding the member called geography. And I'm excluding from that the descendants of South, including the member called South. And if I get any of those members except what's in South, I'm going to take my unit units and multiply it by two. So if this works right, what we see is for the Northeast region and the states in the Northeast region, I have units and in my exclude test, I actually have amounts, but for my South geography, my states, I don't get that included. So the exclude excluded all of those members works extremely well.